Hello everybody, Derek here from Addictive Tips, and in this video we're going to be going over how to install the Electrum Bitcoin wallet. So this is one of the better Bitcoin wallets on Linux. It's also on a lot of other operating systems, but the good thing about Electrum is it runs a fine line between easy to use and lots of different features. So to install this you're going to need to get open a terminal and uh, the good thing about installing this program as opposed to a lot of other Bitcoin wallets is you're not really compiling anything and what you are building or installing is done pretty much automatically. <clears throat> so please check the description below and install the Python related tools that you will need to get this going and then go to the download here. Uh, of course we also have this information on the website in the article but uh, you basically just need this command here. You run the command, enter your password. Now it's going to tell you that running this with root is bad. Um, and of course I already have this installed. Uh, you don't need to worry about running this as, as root because most likely you're not a developer and uh, you need it system wide anyways. So the next step is we can go to the op folder here. So I have an Electrum folder here. And in this folder, I have an icon that I've created. I've also made a I've also made a shortcut on my setup here so that I can find it right here. This, if you're looking for how to get the shortcut for poor, uh, if you're looking to get the shortcut set up for Electrum and get it working like a normal program, because once you install it, you don't really have a shortcut, please check the description. I go over exactly how to get this working, the icon, the shortcut and everything. But once all of that is taken care of and you have the shortcut, if you follow along in the article, you can just look for Electrum in your applications menu here, launch it, and then you can go through the installation. And that's what we're gonna do. So to start off, you need to create a wallet. If you want to create a new wallet, you could just leave this the way it is. You could name it whatever you'd like. Click the next button. From here, it's going to ask you what kind of wallet you're creating. I'm going to set it to standard because I am a standard user. I don't need anything special. I don't need to import any private keys because this is a new Bitcoin wallet. I click the next button and I look at key store and uh, this is going to tell me that I need to create a new seed for my wallet. I can click create new seed. If I already have a seed, I can click that button here. But since this is a new wallet, I'm gonna click create. And of course, for seed type, we're gonna keep it at standard. And uh, I'm showing this to you right now because this wallet is not something that I care about showing to anybody. It's not something that I am worried about someone stealing from me. And it's important that I show you this so you understand exactly what's going on here. So when you create a new wallet with this app, you're gonna get a special, uh, sentence. Now this sentence, you need to write it down on a piece of paper. Do not save it electronically because if you save it electronically, it's very easy for someone to get into your wallet and steal it and steal the contents. So write this down. It might seem a little weird, but write it down and you can go through the options if you want to extend the seed to make it longer. Once you've got it written down, you can click the next button and then write in the the uh, you know, write it into the next page here. I am doing this electronically because I don't have time to write this down and I want to show you the setup process, but I'm not going to save this. And uh, that's that. Once you enter the seed sentence, you can click next. And then of course, at this point, you're going to enter your password. So I'm going to enter a secure password. And then I can click the next button my wallet is generating and here we go I have my Electrum Bitcoin wallet uh, it's installed by just building the the Python app it's really really useful I really enjoy how easy this is to install and like I said before if you are interested in getting a Electrum desktop icon so that you can add it to your desktop like so or so that you can do like uh, you know, if you're using Cinnamon like I am, if you want to add this to your favorites, so it's here, or whatever you want to do, we have that all covered in the description, so please check that out. Anyways, uh, this is the 
Electrum wallet. It's very useful. As you can see, this is my address that people can send money to, and I can send money to whomever I would like in the send function area. And uh, that's how that all works. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, please check out the description to get more information about this app, and I will see you in the next video.